So today I am sharing 23 Amazon items that I use every single day, okay? Th these are my ride or die things I have to have. I think some of them are really interesting. Others are not exciting at all, but again, I, it, they're just like must haves. So I'm going to share them with you in the order in which I use them throughout the day. So there's some really good things towards the end of the video, but I'll have everything linked down below in the description box and pinned in the comment section by the number you see on screen. So when I wake up first thing in the morning, I look at this mirrored alarm clock every single day. Do I use it as an alarm clock? No, but I look at it, you know, in the night, throughout the day. But first thing in the morning, I look at it and I appreciate it because it's just so darn nice. It's so darn nice. I love how it's mirrored. So it looks kind of minimalistic. It just blends in with the surroundings. I love how the numbers are white rather than ugly red or blue or green. It's just so aesthetically nice. And every day I appreciate it. Now I'm always cold in the morning, even in the summer year round, I'm cold. I have have to put on a robe as soon as I wake up just to feel cozy. And it's just so funny because to this day, I still always reach for my Amazon robe that was like $30. And I have a lot of robes. Some were very expensive from UGG, Barefoot Dreams, but this is still my favorite. And it's still, I just double checked, it's still available, um, tons of colors. I have the shade Taupe, but it's, it's plush inside and outside. So many other robes are really soft on the outside, but the inside is scratched and this is just so soft everywhere. I do try to chug a glass of water every single morning just to replenish hydration, but then I beeline for my coffee. I love coffee, guys. It's my thing. Uh, so I recently switched to these glass mugs and that's the next thing I use every day and I love them because not only are they just super pretty, I love the texture of them, the design of them, but they're way healthier because a lot of ceramic mugs that I used to use that you're I'm sure using, unfortunately do have lead in them. Not all of them, but some of them do. And it's hard to tell without buying a tester kit, which ceramic mugs have lead. So I felt a lot better about switching to these glass mugs. And then we have to talk about my Breville espresso machine, which I've mentioned countless times before. A lot of things in this video, I wouldn't want to live without, but this is, really something I wouldn't want to live without. And unfortunately, when we bought this years ago, the price was a lot cheaper and they have since increased the price as the years have gone on. Would I pay the current price? Absolutely, but I know a lot of people don't love coffee as much as me. I make my Americanos. Josh likes to make, you know, his lattes and cappuccinos and flat whites. Like he uses the, the thing to steam milk and you can grind your own beans. It's just fabulous. And that leads me to the next thing, which is my favorite coffee of all time. I do get the whole beans because I can grind it with this machine, but it's the Allegro Organic coffee. And I really think it's important to actually use organic coffee because uh, coffee is actually sprayed, like the beans, are, they're just high in pesticides. Um, and this just tastes just the best. And you can get it on Amazon and I buy it in bulk. Like I'll buy like 20 packages at a time, but you can also get it ground as well. Now, after I make my coffee, I have a little routine where I'll take my coffee and my laptop to our couch. I like to check emails in the morning, maybe respond to comments. I will prep video ideas. And I have a little setup on my couch that just makes everything easier. I'm gonna start with a decorative tray that I just love. And we use that even when I'm not working on the couch. This is just nice to have if you have a couch where you don't have anywhere to set things, like maybe you bring in a drink or you bring in food and it's like, where do I put it down? So I'll put my coffee there. It's also just a nice place to contain things like remotes. Um, it's just, I don't know, it looks really nice on the couch and on our ottoman. Now I also use this every morning, which is a laptop tray. I love it so much because it is super gushy. It allows me to set my laptop here and be at a really nice angle to actually work. And then this little slot you can set your phone in at just the right angle and kind of just work on a lot of things at one time. Sometimes I'll have YouTube videos or a podcast playing on my phone while I'm working on the computer and it just passes the time and makes it more enjoyable. This is actually a mouse pad, which I have found. I love using an actual wireless mouse for my laptop. I can really do things way faster than using that trackpad. I think I'm pretty good at the trackpad, but if you switch to a mouse, I think you'll just improve productivity 
by a lot. Now, once I am done on the computer, I will head to the bathroom to freshen up and get ready for the day. So next I wanna talk about my toothbrush and my toothpaste. I actually recently switched to a new toothpaste that is so good, please hear me out. But let's start with this toothbrush, which is very different than your average toothbrush. It is a flossing toothbrush. I think I mentioned it like six months ago. Maybe you missed that video. This is different because there are microscopic bristles that are super, super thin and longer that literally like get in between your teeth and like floss in between your teeth. And it's just the best toothbrush I have ever found. Now this toothpaste by the brand Hello is what I recently switched to and I've been loving it because it is an activated charcoal toothpaste. It's so good for whitening. They do have like a regular fresh mint toothpaste version as well, but you should try the activated charcoal because I have tried charcoal toothpaste in the past and I haven't loved it because it's often very gritty and grainy and I don't love the way it feels on my teeth and that is not the way this is. But it is really weird when you're using it because it's super black on your teeth, but it pulls out all of the stains and it just works really well. But the best thing is the ingredients are so healthy. It doesn't have fluoride, it doesn't have glycerin, it doesn't have parabens. It just checks all of my boxes and I'm very, very picky when it comes to toothpaste because I used to have tons of cavities and it was just like all this, this whole thing. And once I switched to a healthier toothpaste, plus made some diet changes, I haven't had any of that. Now, do I still have teeth issues from like bad uh, root canals? Yeah, which I'm maybe one day I'll give you an update on that. I just hate talking about it, but <laughs> this is a really good toothpaste and it really does whiten your teeth. Next, I put on deodorant and I feel like over the years, I've recommended maybe four or five different natural deodorants to you without aluminum and just like good ingredient deodorants. And I love them all, but I've, I've come to the realization there's really just one that I find myself always grabbing. It's like my all time favorite one and it's Schmitz. It's the one that if a friend texts me and says, which one should I buy? That's the one I ultimately say. And I love how it just feels like a, a regular deodorant, just the consistency of it. It works really well. It doesn't leave armpit stains on your clothes and it comes in tons of scents. I will then brush my hair and this is the wet brush. I have it in probably four or five different colors. I have them up here in my closet. I have them in the bathroom. I have them in my studio basement where I live stream it. Like I have to have this wet brush throughout my whole house. I use it so much, probably because I have a lot of hair, but my point is I obviously use this every single day, but if you do not have a wet brush, you need to buy one. They're so inexpensive and they just glide through your hair when it's wet. Obviously you can also use it when it's dry. It's just the breast, not breast, best brush of all time. Now I don't use this next product at this very moment all the time, but since we're already in the bathroom talking about hair, I will at some point throughout the day use this Kenra Hair Shine. It's mostly because it works so well at just instantly adding shine to your hair, but also I will spray it on my hair before I film. Like it just literally serves no purpose other than just adding shine to your hair, but I think it's the mist is just so fine and the product doesn't make your hair oily. I just think that women would love it if they would try it because it just, makes your hair so pretty. If you're enjoying this video, or maybe you just love shopping on Amazon or just finding random useful items, please consider subscribing down below. Now that we're done in the bathroom, I'm going to head upstairs to my closet and put on some clothes. Now, obviously I do wear different clothes every day, but there are a few pieces from Amazon that I find myself wearing way too much and they're just amazing. So I want to share them with you. First is this that I'm wearing. It's this jumpsuit pants onesie romper thing. I never know what the heck to call this thing, but I have it in multiple colors and I love it so much. I'll just throw on a tank top, a cami, a t-shirt, literally just something underneath. And then I just slip this whole thing on and I love it. I just, I, I lounge in it. I will run errands in it. I'll go outside in it. I'll go to dinner in it. I wear it all the time and it totally looks like the Free People one. This is a much better price point. I think if you're gonna buy one, start with black, but then you could branch out to some fun colors. I also wear sweatpants far too much. I live in them and, and it's this specific pair, okay? I need to get a different color because this is so obvious that I'm always wearing them because they're yellow. You don't have to get them in this mustard yellow color. But guys, they are so thick and soft and, and they look designer. In fact, some random lady at, at, at airport security 
flagged me down. I thought maybe she was a subscriber. Nope, she just wanted to know where my sweatpants are from. So they are very, very nice. They're just so comfortable. You can get them in a more normal color like black, gray, beige, or something fun like this yellow. Moving right along, we're getting into random things, guys. This is a phone stand. I know a lot of you are not content creators or influencers or whatever the heck you wanna say, but maybe some of you are, or maybe you guys would find this useful. This is the best phone stand ever. It looks kind of dirty, uh, but it has served me well. It's so strong and sturdy. You can just set it up, insert your phone right here and, and flip it around, give it all the angles. And I use this every single day. Now, because I am, a content creator. I'm constantly ordering products and clothes and different things to test out and try. So almost every single day, I am getting boxes delivered to my door. But I know I'm not the only one. I know some of you do the same thing. And so you totally need to try this slice box cutter. It's literally just like a plastic thing. Maybe it's not plastic. I think it's plastic, but your kids can, you know, play with this and not get cut. But let me just tell you, it slices those boxes so darn good. This is so inexpensive. And even Josh with his like man knife was super impressed with how much better this actually works. Now, when I drive my car, I always use this key fob, but it's the key fob cover that I am talking about. You can get a key fob cover on Amazon for whatever vehicle you have and make your key fob look so much more stylish and chic and cool. So I have a white vehicle, so I got it in white with chrome accents and it just looks so much nicer. It's also very inexpensive. Uh, and it's just, it's like a little upgrade that you appreciate every day. So all you have to do is just go to Amazon and type in the make and model of your car and then add on key fob cover. And it will give you tons of options. Now, another thing that I do every day, or I at least try to do every day is water my plants. Now there is a specific product I want to share with you because it's been a total game changer for the plants in my living room and also the flowers outside that I try to keep alive. So if you're somebody that's just, you think you kill everything or, or you just wanna see your plants or your flowers just thrive, I'm telling you guys, you should buy this miracle Grow powder stuff. I will link it. I forget even exactly what it's called, but you just add it to the water and you only use this like once a week but it has truly made my plants look so much better and my flowers outside look so much brighter and just healthier. It's a really good price and, and it lasts for such a long time. Alrighty guys, so we've gone through a lot of the day when it's dinner time. We're heading to the kitchen and there is something that we've had for the last maybe like four or five months. It's another Breville machine that is too expensive, but it's this Breville air fryer that to be honest, it's too big for my kitchen. There is one that is smaller, but this is just the one that did everything. And if you have a bigger kitchen, this is so nice. And I do really love it. And I use it every single day. But again, I just wish it wasn't so big, but it is an air fryer that does literally everything you can imagine. It bakes, it broils. It's a, the best air fryer ever for French fries. I mean, like healthy French fries. I will also toast things with it. I will I will roast things in it, like roasted veggies. There's just so many things I do with this and I tend to use it way more than my actual oven, truly. So if you've seen this around or you've been kind of on the fence, if you have room for it in your kitchen, I absolutely think it's worth it. Now, after you make food, then you have to clean the kitchen and it's just ah, like, I don't like cleaning at all. But one thing that I have found very enjoyable every day is a Swedish dishcloth. Yes, so shout out to my friend, Brittany, who's also a YouTuber. She has an Amazon brand named Belter and she sells Swedish dishcloths, which are reusable paper towels. They are so nice and they, they start out really hard and then water hits them and they're, they're really moldable and squishy and they are so much more absorbent than a paper towel. Here's a demonstration that I filmed months back. I mean, it just sucks up all the liquid and you can clean and wipe and uh, I use it in my kitchen, I'll use it in my bathroom and then I'll throw it in the dishwasher and I'll sanitize it and keep using it and it's just so much more cost effective. So I inquired about a discount code and she gave me one for you guys. So I'll put it here on the screen you can use this code at checkout and get a discount. So when we've made it to the end of the day and it's time to wind down and relax, I must take off my makeup. And the only thing I use 
are these makeup eraser cloths. Uh, I don't use any type of face wash or any type of product. I only use these makeup eraser cloths with just water and it removes all of my makeup. And I swear there's something with the texture of these that not only does it get off all of my makeup, but it also like gently exfoliates and it's just, it's just the best. I have so many of them and you just throw them in the laundry and reuse them over and over and over again. Highly recommend if you haven't given these a try. This next thing might seem kind of gimmicky. I don't care. It's not totally worth it. You get 50 of these facial sponges for like less than 10 bucks. So it might seem weird, but just listen. It's almost like that Swedish dishcloth thing where it's hard and thin, but as soon as water touches it, it expands into a full blown sponge, like a thick sponge. Now you could use this to wash your face if you like to use a specific facial cleanser. I like to actually apply solution to this, like some of my skincare, and it just feels like a spa experience. And it feels like really thick and nice. And it's just disposable. Like you just use it one time and throw it away. Again, you get 50 of them. <laughs> for less than $10. Everything that I shared in this video will be linked down below and also pinned in the comment section. Please subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.